Hmm. 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 People have been coming to rejoice with you. Your job has been revalidated once more by the uh, appeal of Supreme Court. What does this mean for you, Your Excellency? An energizing spirit and a challenge to work harder without distraction from this moment on. Uh, we've concentrated on uh, pulling Nigeria <laughs> from the bull trap of depression. And we understand the sovereign of the country. You don't need a distraction uh, to be able to concentrate on building a new economy for the people, an inclusive one for that matter. And the judgment of the Supreme Court put a stop to shenanigans. <laughs> Put a stop to innuendos. Put a stop to lies or trial hmm. in the media and public place. Like the court no, has no. demonstrated in this visible no, commitment no, to rule of law no, no, no. and humanity. No, no, no. And their commitment to do justice no, no, no. for all Nigerians, no, no, no. regardless of uh, no, no, no. ethnic, no, no, no. religious, or oh, any other biases. So we use the strength of our diversity to build a stronger and prosperous Nigeria. And that's my belief. Now that your mandate is sure, sir, and uh, Nigerians are now waiting to see what comes out from this administration. So how are you rewarding Nigerians uh, with the mandate they've given to you, your, your Excellency? I've started from day one to work hard, regardless of you know, uh, the court cases, okay? And uh, just strengthen my resolve uh, to do more. A challenge of this nature, uh, and a, a future of this nature is more work, and more hard work, more dedication. Just appeal to the sense of patriotism of Nigeria to have a change of mindset. Let us be positive about our country, be ready to contribute in all ways possible. There's no promise of El Dorado from day one. We're all in this boat of diversity. A member of the same family, living in the same house, but staying in different rooms. And it is important that we recognize that we have no other country but this one. So 